Hey guys, the Chinese manufacturer Yumodigi has a series of smartphones A11, which includes Yumodigi A11 and Yumodigi A11 Pro Max. It is interesting that there is no Yumodigi A11 Pro. Perhaps it will be released later. Anyway, in this video I want to tell you about Yumodigi A11 Tab. This is another new product from A11 series, but it is not a smartphone. This is a tablet. Yumodigi A11 Tab has 10.4-inch display with 2K resolution, Helio P22 chipset, 4 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage, Android 11 operating system. The new tablet is not on sale yet, but there is a page on AliExpress with full specifications list. There is also a video of Yumodigi A11 Tab on Yumodigi YouTube channel, so we can see how the new tablet will look like. Is Yumodigi A11 Tab is good deal in 2021? Let's find out! First, the new tablet from Yumodigi has 10.4-inch display and resolution of 2K, 1200 by 2000 pixels. The Chinese manufacturer says that the screen-to-body ratio is 84%. It is really good for the tablet. Another feature of Yumodigi A11 tab is thin body. It is only 7.9mm. The weight of the tablet is 486 grams. It looks like a tablet is made of plastic, but the frame is metal. The new device has a docking port at the bottom, so it will support external keyboard. We can also see the option with keyboard on AliExpress. However, most likely it will be sold additionally, and we don't know the price of the keyboard yet. From other sides, a new Yumodigi tablet will come with tablet case in the package. That's very good. Yumodigi A11 tab is equipped with USB Type-C charging port and hybrid slot for dual SIM and microSD memory card. I'm surprised by the fingerprint reader, because most tablets don't have it. Probably the fingerprint scanner is located under the power button, like the latest Yumodigi smartphones. Talking about hardware of Yumodigi A11 tab, the new tablet looks like a big budget smartphone. It is equipped with Helio P22 chipset, 4 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage. We have already tested many smartphones on Helio P22 processor on our channel Tech Brothers. Its performance is enough to run all the apps as well as most games. Yumodigi A11 tab also has the latest Android 11 operating system. The battery has a good capacity of 8300 mAh, but it supports only 10 w charging. Finally, the rear camera has 16 megapixel sensor, while the front camera is 8 megapixels. Of course, the new tablet supports dual band Wi Fi, Bluetooth 5.0, and GPS. You know, as I already said, Yumodigi A11 tab looks like a budget smartphone, but with 10.4 inch display. The hardware is entry level, so probably the tablet is not designed for work and heavy games. The manufacturer says that this is audio visual feast. It means that Yumodigi A11 tab is for watching videos and surfing social media. Right now, the price of Yumodigi A11 tab is $250 on AliExpress, but I think it will be under $200 when the tablet will go on sale. Maybe even the price will be $150. Thank you for watching this video. Write in the comments below what do you think about the new Yumodigi tablet.